President Biden just signed a bill into law today boosting domestic semiconductor production and research in the United States. Top tech executives attended that signing in an apparent push to make the United States more competitive with China. The legislation aims to alleviate a semiconductor shortage in the U.S. that has affected everything from cars to video games. I want to bring in ABC's Zoreen Shah for more on this. Uh, Zoreen, the White House says these chips um, and this law in general will really help the economy. Can you walk us through that? Yeah, Diane, you said the key word, the economy. I mean, we saw that recent polling that was out this week. And in every single category, when it comes to the economy, Biden's water, Biden's numbers are underwater. Americans don't feel confident when it comes to the economy and Joe Biden. And so this is a big move for him, signing this bill today. He wants to build semiconductor facilities here in the U.S. He wants to lower the cost of certain items that are sold. He wants them to be built right here at home. And look, before the pandemic, you had a shortage of these chips. Every and then the pandemic hit, people wanted new technology, they wanted to communicate, and then there were supply chain issues. So the president hopes that by making them here at home, it's going to be easier for people to get that tech that they need. He hopes it will drive down the cost, and he hopes that it will also create jobs. Doreen, the president's also saying this will help our national security in the United States. How does that part of this work? Yeah, I mean, look, a lot of these chips are made in China, right? And so that is a big concern for him. He wants it built here. I mean, these are the chips that go into things like phones, your computers, the things that maybe you want to maybe protect. And so these are the sorts of things that Biden wants to have made here at home and it considers really important to have made here. Zoreen Shah, thank you. Mm -hmm. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.